are off again uh, to go check on the plane and ended up, uh, here it is Friday again already and uh, ended up um, going up there last week because we did the last video and uh, saw the progress of where they were at and uh, picked up all of the old avionics and uh, those are now in my possession and a lot of them are listed on eBay, not as selling as quickly as I hoped they would, but um, you know, they are older avionics and um, nobody's gonna be doing a major retrofit with them, so probably for spare parts or uh, something that's failed on somebody's plane. So anyway, um, again, Friday afternoon, I'm gonna be in for about an hour and a half drive up to uh, Columbia Oscar 22 to see how they're doing up there at uh, Velocity Avionics. So um, let's take a trip. So I was walking out and saw this out on the ramp and I just had to come look at it to see what the stink this was. This looks like a station air turbocharged, but I've never seen an exhaust system like this. That's pretty stinking amazing. So it must make things a whole lot quieter is kind of what I'm thinking on this plane. Wow. Very nice. Looks like it might be a uh, photography kind of plane or something. Yeah, they've got some stuff in it. Oh yeah, it does look like that. Let's walk around here. Wow, one of the first. Cool. So we made it to the airport and here we are. Little pan around here. Walking out to velocity. The gate was closed this time. But we're going to go take a peek and see if they've got her underway. Better than they did last time. And um, here is where we're at at this point. They are making wiring progress here. And um, Kind of show you here what they've done. They've got the panels out. They pulled the control yokes. So I think we're going to go ahead and order new um, Avion control yokes for it too. They're going to redo this so that we're going to have just all aluminum panel on everything. But you can kind of see inside here of what they're doing with all the wiring and then all the little heat shrinks and labels on everything up there. And um, we ordered a new glare shield, so that's going to go in over the top of all of this. And then the new um, compass will go up on top of that. But the glare shield is going to have LED in it that will light all of the, um, the instruments now with uh, a white LED light that will be dimmable. And so all of the um, inspection plates are still out. They're working on getting servos and things stuffed into the back of the plane. And... 
coming along nicely. So I'm hoping that uh, in a couple of weeks we will have this puppy up and running. There is a servo that is up in this wing here that is mounted there, one of the new autopilot servos. And then this is the cable that comes down um, with the connector and everything on it. But um, still going strong. Everybody here is really humping along on the plane. And so this is where we were last time with the... Uh, the engine and the, the power flow exhaust. So um, I can't wait to hear this little speedster. But um, same thing on this end, we've got the uh, other servo motor is gonna be going over here somewhere, or this is the magnetometer on that. I'm not too sure which one, but um, maybe it's just one servo motor. Here's our old servo motor that's gonna come out. So you can kind of see from the side that these things, this thing's huge um, compared to the new um, Garmin servo motors. So that's our update. And um, coming along, you know, it's a wiring nightmare, so to speak, but um, these guys know what they're doing. And then um, with the, uh, the panel, they're kind of, this is kind of where we're at with the panel and the layout of it. So. This will be co-pilot side with the gauges in here. And then we're looking at the G5s here, altimeter, vertical speed, engine monitor, and the second CDI, airspeed, and then the um, turn and bank indicator down there. But with the new control yokes, um, which are here, that I'm showing you a picture of that uh, I want to try to get from Avion. Um, and then this is what the new glare shield is going to look like. Um, I just am really kind of jazzed that this thing's going to um, bring this up to look like a brand new Cessna pan. So anyway, um, thanks for watching and um, we're going to give it another week and come back up on uh, Friday of next week and see how we're doing.